and welcome. So today let's talk about polarizers. Polarizers are a handy tool to have in the lab. They can be used to investigate polymer orientation. They can be used to pull out your signal, make it stronger when you're analyzing monolayers and ultra thin films. Just recently we did a tip of the week on using a polarizer at Brewster's angle for eliminating fringing in your film transmission measurement. Now it's important to understand the orientation of your your polarizer. So at Pike, we always orient our polarizers in one way, and that is when we set the polarizer at zero, the wire grid lines of your IR polarizer are running horizontally. When you change that angle to 90, now those wire grid lines will run vertically. So what does that mean to you? That means your P and S polarization will depend on not only this angle, but how the polarizer is positioned in your accessory, whether it's on its side or vertical. So let me show you what I mean. So I have two accessories with me today, one being the VMAX, where the polarizer is slid into the polarizer slot on its side, and the other is the 80 spec, where the polarizer is inserted vertically. Now, to achieve P polarization for each of those, I will need to set the polarizer at 90 for the VMAX and slide it in to the polarizer slot. Now, with the orientation of the polarizer on the 80 spec, I'll need to set that polarizer at zero to get the same P polarization polarization. So in summary, be sure that you have your polarizer set properly to achieve your S or P polarization, whichever your measurement needs. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.